Hey guys. <laughs> I'm Tanya Lucille, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I would love for you to go and subscribe to this channel. It's the only way to beat the YouTube algorithm and grow. But that aside, today we're going to be organizing a junk drawer. Um, this junk drawer is awful. It's so bad and I've been putting it off for so long. And I'm curious, where is your worst junk drawer at? Mine is in my kitchen and it's right over here and it is so bad, so bad. <laughs> All right, so I want this to be fairly quick um, because I know that just organizing this drawer is going to bring me more peace in my home and in my kitchen that is used three times a day, right? I mean, we're always in the kitchen. It's never ending. Dishes, cooking, feeding your family, it's just always there every single day. So being organized is extremely helpful and it's a great way to reset. I have been off track yet again. Uh, the displacement of my surgery pushed back even further, really tripped me up bad <laughs> mentally. Um, so I'm just trying to reset everything and get back on track. Um, I got off with my eating a little bit, but I'm back on track. It's a new day. Thus is life, right? Three steps forward, <laughs> one step behind. It happens not only to me, to everybody. So let's be real and know that life is a journey and it's progress over perfection. And I'm here, I'm showing up for myself, for my family and I'm going to organize this drawer and I'm going to take you with me. Okay, I'm going to try to give you a really quick um, just look at it before I even... Uh, Start this process. I mean, look at this. This is a deep drawer. It goes all the way down. This drawer is so ridiculously bad. It's just awful. I mean, literally, this is a baby spoon. What is this doing in this drawer? All right, let's do this. Okay, the first thing I'm gonna do is just empty the drawer. The drawer is empty and you can kind of see that. What I'm going to do right now is just spray it and uh, wipe it down so that way it dries while I open it.
Okay, so now we're back here. I think the quickest way to do this is to just break it into categories, obviously. Um, so far, I'm gonna pull out everything that I just don't even want anymore, like totally in the of. These were used as bread bags. This was from um, Easy Bake Oven. This is the dumbest thing. This cutting board goes elsewhere. Okay, so now I need to decide, am I gonna get rid of all of my measuring cups? Cause there's a lot of them. And just simplify down to this. Sometimes it's nice to have extra ones, especially if you keep them in containers, which I may do. I may take a couple of the, the cups or the half cups to put into uh, my containers that I keep my sugar or my flour in. Maybe, or just get rid of them. It's hard to make these decisions sometimes, isn't it? Like having extra, do you really need it? There's just a ton here. So I may just float this. All right, let me put this away. And then I'll show you kind of what I got going on here. Okay, here's what I have. This is all stuff I'm getting rid of. This is stuff that is going out to the garage because I still, minus this, this is garbage. I don't know why those are there. Okay, um, except a couple of these, I might put in, because sometimes I need these for mason jars. Um, I have a lot more in the garage, so I'm gonna put them in my bottom drawer, which has stuff organized 
in there. Okay, this drawer is extremely empty. I love it, love it, love it, love it. This drawer is mostly organized, except these get a little... I could probably go through and get rid of some of those because that happens sometimes. So, okay. Another drawer, another day. Anyway, okay, garbage pile right here. Garage storage. Thinking about dumping. This is my keeper pile. Um, these cookie cutters will be saved because they will go up in my cookie cutter um, jar up there where I store my cookie cutters. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to put them here because I have a child who will get right up here and do that for me. Makes life easy. Part of me is just like dump them. Part of me is like don't. Why is that such a difficult decision? All right. Okay, because I've downsized this drawer so much, I may actually reallocate this drawer for something else. But for right now, um, this is good. And it's so much easier. I'm gonna take this stuff out to the garage. I ended up tossing everything here. And I figured, you know, if I need to repurchase this stuff, it's like, Plastic pennies, on, I mean, it's like a dollar, a couple bucks. I'm not going to stress about it. And we're going to call that done. My garbage is dirty. Anyway, to the garage. And we'll call this an accomplishment. <laughs> Bye, guys. This was my Costco find that um, I'm putting in this drawer and just show you how I reorganized it. That's a wrap. Thanks for joining with me in the Word of God, in the kitchen, and in the home. Bye, guys.